Sector is clear. Give us everything we got! All wings! Hello everyone, I'm Foolish Beer. The celebration update has dropped. And so, I'm gonna be going into it. I already made a video about the First Order. This is the video about the Resistance. For the Resistance. You know, I like saying that, because, you know, who doesn't love awesome battle cries that have absolutely no effect on the enemy? You know? That's just my opinion, but... Whatever, let's play that charge here. Let's mow down some of this. And I missed. To say I missed is an understatement. I killed. And I just died. Luckily, I have over 500 battle points. So I'm gonna bring in a sentry on steroids known as Magician Gunner. Yeah! This guy's a nut. Oh wait. Unless it's not a guy. I'm not entirely sure of. But there's more than one of the same gunner, so I don't really think that matters. The defensive stand back here. Yeah, the Abyssin Gunner can do this. Basically turn into a sentry, where the blaster builds no heat. Also has an anti-armor mode, which is basically an explosive sentry. Wow. I'm gonna go out of anti-armor. Alright, nice. All my abilities are in I'm not in recharge. Charge! Yeah, the Avengers Gunner can do that, too. The Avengers Gunner can charge toward enemies and knock them over. That's highly powerful. Then we can make another melee attack against it, because I don't know how powerful it is. It's under stance. And there's someone behind me. Let's move. The missing gunner's weakness is an enemy from behind. So if an enemy comes up from behind, behind him or her, the missing gunner, okay. I just got an idea. It's a really, really bad idea. I'm in a rain down covering fire from up here. But there's no one up here, so I'm in a rain. I'm gonna switch to anti-armor mode for this, because it's super easy to hit your target in anti-armor mode. JK, why not? Oh, shit. And my blast got overheated. They're coming for me. Defensive stance, you can just go on a basic rampage because your blaster builds no heat. And every time you defeat an enemy, you get some extra health. So that's sweet. You guys are gonna think this is crazy, but I think I just need some light up on the <laughs> Oh wait, no, it's just something like that. I'm, I'm really Watch out! Never mind, if I see a lone enemy, charge. Charge! Ooh, man. Ooh. Ooh, this is. There's no amount of enemies an Avisian Gunner can't take out, but... The Avisian Gunner can just be taken out first, and that's exactly what happened. Luckily, this guy is much more discreet. It's called a Capex 5. With a pistol and a truncheon. He's gonna go in there. Incoming Morse. 
Oh yeah, this guy can call in an ab orbital bombardment. And I'm gonna do exactly that right now. Watch this. And just like that, the squad was dead. And so was I. It's really stupid that I was doing that in oversimplified toys, but here's how much YouTube can change a person. Know what I mean? Watch out! Fire mission on the Rapid fire out. Overcharge! We gotta move. Retreat. An Avisian gunner would be really good Blast right now. Beacon in place. Calling in a fire mission. I missed. I did get someone though. Surprise. Oh yeah, rapid fire this. I'm gonna try calling in another one. This. You know what, radiation? This isn't gonna fly. I'm gonna trunk it on attack the first person that comes to that door. Done. When you're less yet? Soon. Incoming mortar. We really missed that, but hey, what gives? Great. Let's go. I'm gonna deploy a scanner beacon up. Scanning targets. One guy just And he just disappeared off the radar. I'm gonna make a punch on attack against him. He's gonna go right in the back. That's why I always like to play these beacons out there. You can deploy an orbital strike if you need it. Pretty sweet ability, if you ask me. Because, you know, orbital strike. Next time that Mortar Strike and Beacon location. That's overkill, but I love that. I cannot get any money for that order of strike. Shoot Placing beacon. Watch out. I have died. I think that was pretty obvious, but I still felt it. Rapid fire. I'm gonna throw my skin and beacon out of the courtyard. I'm going to explode and explode and explode. There, beacon in place. I'm detecting people. Oh, no, 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 no. Leave that up. Okay. They hit all right. And I got a bunch of people. So that's good. Awesome. Scan over here. Beacon in position. Nobody is in this position. That would probably explain that. I think he's gone. I have no idea about that. Rapid fire is good if you gotta take down multiple enemies. Or if you just wanna go into overkill. The real strength is this weapon, the truncheon, which is a, a chain melee attack. Fire mission on the 
No! And I just died. If I managed to trigger that bombardment, I would have killed a ton of stormtroopers. Man, what force attack? Scanning targets. Do that. Sending fire mission now. Got him. FM twenty three oh nine. Protection. Watch out! Run! I survived. While I think that's really obvious, I still think it's amazing. I survived lots of tough spots before. Not easy, but been done. Been there, done that. I'm gonna play scanning in the courtyard. The guy comes out. Portal strike. And hit. Then again, an orbital strike would have reduced this place to rubble, so... Strike. Sending more strike to one. Some you can take damage from an orbital strike. That you don't. I guess that. Incoming more strike. Guy's supposed to be in the shadows. No one sees him. Well, the same gunner is like up close and personal with him. I think it makes a very interesting. Finding targets. Requesting mortar strike. I don't know why I did that. I just thought it wouldn't detonate. I guess. And I didn't realize that was that first order soldier was dead. I thought he was alive. And, oh wait, other way around. I thought he was alive. I thought he was dead, but he was in fact alive. Charge. Area scan activated. In place. Calling in a mortar strike. No, I just died. Let's bring in the Novician gunner. I want to raise the place to the ground. Let's go, 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 go. Yeah. The Vizian Gunner's damage output is off the absolute in charge. It's amazing. That's all I gotta say about it. 